Shot. What is up, trainers? Your boy Trainer Pyrosan here with another review. Review of the new and improved. No, it's just a new Pokemon Select series articulated figures. Trainer Team. Okay, you know what? Trainer Team series Dragapult. This is the first time we get a Dragon Ball figure and articulated scale. We have one, received one, I think, by Tomy, and we have received Dreepy by the same company, but I don't have that Dreepy. So, yeah, but I do have the Dragon Ball, so we will do size comparisons. See Dragon Ball right here in black artwork. You see Dragon Ball and Land Soria. I can't pronounce that. Articulated trainer team. You see Pokemon Pikachu Select. On the side, you see a, a, another image of um, a Dragon Ball with Dreepy in his head. You see Pokemon on top. And in the back, you see Pokemon we have and have not reviewed. We reviewed Typhlosion, Charizard. We're reviewing him now and can't wait for Samurai. Um, series 4. And on the other side, you see nothing. Let's get it open. Just a tip for you guys um, and girls. Uh, just know they always come in a stand at the top of the box. It doesn't matter if they fly or not. They come in a stand top of the box. But in this case, of course, because Dragpole is... I think it's... Is it a fish? I'm pretty sure... I don't even remember. Anyway, let's get to the figure out. Now, first impressions, this figure looks amazing. I don't know the articulation yet. Um, we're not gonna get into that for another five seconds, but just to show you what it looks like on the stand. The stand is very stiff, but you plug it in from the back and take it down to get it to look right. And yeah, let's get a full shot of that if we can. That's him and it's or her in his full glory. Anyway, let's get to the articulation. Moving it full back, the head is is the head oh the head is on a, a hinge, so it can look all the way up, so look all the way down. It doesn't move it moves side to side barely. Dreepies do not remove. I don't know, they don't move They're like little heads poking out, but they don't remove and they don't move either. Now he does have a ab articulation. He does go forward a lot more, so you can't get him to look down and not back a lot, but he does get back a lot for it to look like he's swimming or flying. Um, do they move? And a little bit side to side. You see the arms are on a hinge, so he does, they do move circular around. And the arms are, on, oh, they double jointed elbows. That's, that's nice. And then the hands are on a hinge. And do they swivel around? I don't think they, no, they don't turn around, but that is very good for a drag pole figure. Same with this hand. Um, on this leg, he does, Oh, it does hinge in and out, it's just very stiff. This hinge all the way down, and the knees is single jointed, and the feet are jointed too, so you can't get them to kick. Same with this foot, let me get that bug out. And the tail is on a, uh, what you call, bendy wire, so you can't get them to look very natural in its poses. Yeah, they're awesome. And the tail is translucent, I didn't know that. I should have known, I have another figure of him. But to look at the figure real quick, you see his eyes are very yellow, very, Ominous, very mischievous, actually. Dreepies are painted very nicely. Let's zoom in them. Dreepies look terrified, to be honest. Um, <laughs> they, look, they look very good, though. And Dragapult looks like he's just a mastermind of everything. The paint is nice on the figure. The red paint, you see the back of the figure. If you focus, little shading going down. The hands are painted nicely. Then you see the little arrows on the stomach going down here and the rest is like blue except for the translucents does he have the seasons on his oh, no it doesn't have a series on his foot but yeah this figure is awesome let's get some size comparisons in so in relative size he does match up good with the um uh what do you call it the uh gallo starters this is um the wicked cool toys or jazz wares electabuzz the jazz wares in the same line Jazz Wars Typhlosion and um, for Alligator from Hasbro, favorite Pokemon figure of all time. Um, yeah, let's do, well, they do add up, they do size up correctly. Um, let's do a size, size up. So from head to toe, if I had to, well, I have a measuring tape right here, but I'm gonna measure Dragapult from the bottom of his butt to the top of his head. He's about four, four and a quarter, four and a half inches. From the side of his head to the other side of his head is about nine, nine and a half, nine inches, nine and a quarter inches. And from the tail, from the base of the tail all the way to the top is about eight inches. So it's very, very, very big. And from the stomach is three inches. But yeah, this figure is very awesome. And for the last size comparison, we will do the Tomy version of this fi figure. <clears throat> now, you know, the Jazz Wars figure is much superior, but Tomy version is not bad either. It has a lighter 
pale um beige color not beige more like tan a light pale paint compared to the yellow on um this dragon bolt but i'm not sure which one is accurate i'm not the biggest stickler for um thing but i should have known this was translucent on the tail because this was translucent. i'm surprised at that i'm very impressed but yeah the this one this one pales compared to, to this one but the jaguars one is the best one if you don't have this one please get this one and guys if you love this review subscribe for more <laughs> Please so share this video, like the video, comment your favorite figure, for, comment if you like this figure, comment if you, what figure you want next in the line, and comment if you can't wait for Samurai. And anyway guys, I'll try to get more reviews out. I, I have a few ideas what I want to do, some classic figures, some retro figures, some new figures. But anyway guys, keep training.